The Kurganets represents a next-generation Russian armored personnel carrier APC. Its development is believed to have started in 2011, occurring alongside the creation of an entire family of related vehicles. The development process was shrouded in secrecy, with its public unveiling only taking place in 2015. By that time, only a limited number of pre-production vehicles had been manufactured. Manufacturer testing of the vehicle began in 2017, revealing numerous issues related to design, production, and the potential procurement of foreign components. Despite this, as of 2022, the Kurganets APC has not yet entered full-rate production and deployment. Additionally, the tractor plant's concern, responsible for the development and production of the Kurganets, faced financial troubles, nearly reaching a state of bankruptcy. In 2022, the general director of the concern was arrested on charges of misappropriating funds intended for Kurganet's development, along with two other officials. This vehicle is commonly referred to as the Kurganets, although its exact designation might differ. Specifically, the version designed for infantry combat is known as the Kurganets 25. Both iterations belong to the same new generation armored vehicle family, with the APC and IFV versions differing primarily in their turrets. The Kurganets is a tracked vehicle, contrasting with the current trend of replacing tracked APCs with wheeled alternatives due to lower costs for purchase and maintenance. However, wheeled APCs tend to have reduced off-road capabilities compared to tracked vehicles. Notably, Russia has also developed the Bumerang 8x8 APC, unveiled on the same day as the Kurganets. The Bumerang was developed alongside the Kurganets vehicle family, allowing for interchangeability of automotive components between the two. The Kurganets APC was created from scratch, not based on any previous Russian armored vehicle designs. Many of the typical issues seen in other Russian armored vehicles, such as cramped crew compartments and egress points, were addressed and resolved. Constructed with a welded hull and turret, the Kurganets boasts armor composed of a special aluminum alloy. The vehicle features modular armor with additional modules for increased protection against specific threats or mission requirements. The APC includes a double hull floor to enhance defense against mine explosions, and its protection level is believed to surpass that of the BTR series 8x8 APCs. The Kurganets APC is equipped with an unmanned turret armed with a 12.7mm machine gun. However, this limited armament suggests that the vehicle would typically be kept away from the front line. The vehicle accommodates a crew of three and can transport eight dismounts through a rear door entrance. Unusually, the Kurganets lacks roof hatches for dismounting troops, differing from previous Soviet and Russian armored troop transport vehicles. Powered by a diesel engine, the new generation IFV offers two engine options, a 17-liter CHT Zerotrack 2V06 opposed engine generating 450 to 510 horsepower, or a YMZ 780 inline engine with dual turbochargers delivering 750 horsepower. The engine selection for the production model remained uncertain as of early 2017. It's planned that the same engine will be used in the Bumerang 8x8 APC. The engine is situated at the front of the hull and is paired with a six-speed automatic gearbox. The vehicle employs a hydropneumatic suspension system with variable ground clearance. Despite its substantial appearance, the Kurganets APC is fully amphibious. In water, it's propelled by two rear-mounted water jets and features new amphibious propulsion technology, achieving a water speed of 10 km per hour, notably, add-on armor blocks enhance buoyancy and stability on water. The Kurganets chassis forms the basis for an entire family of vehicles, with various variants developed and in production, Kurganets 25 Infantry Fighting Vehicle, equipped with a distinct remotely controlled turret armed with a 30mm cannon, coaxial 7.62mm machine gun, and four Cornet M anti-tank missile launchers. Planned upgrades include the new Afghanet active protection system and a countermeasure system to reduce vulnerability to enemy semi-automated guided ATGWs. Command Vehicle Armored Ambulance 
Armored Recovery Vehicle Light Tank Air Defense Vehicle Armored Engineer Vehicle